Hey guys, welcome back to Pinchy Pennies with Priscilla. I thought I would come on in a more calmer tone to actually show you guys the haul that I did at Rite Aid. I have not been to CVS yet, and I'll probably get to them either later tonight or sometime this week. Not a rush for them at all. But I decided to go out to Rite Aid um, because I saw the Dow deal on, um, I saw that deal on Slick Deals, and I thought it was worth me um, making a trip to Rite Aid today. So anyway, um, let me tell you about that first. Now, the deal with the Dow hand soap is there is a double dip going on. The, one is called a um, Dow Halloween soap, and then the other one is the weekly deal. Well, the Dow Halloween soap is a monthly deal. The regular Dow hand soap is the weekly deal for this week. They are supposed to be two for four dollars, and you get, I believe, a one dollar plus up for each one of them. And uh, let me see. <clears throat> so they did ring up for. Let's see, the Halloween ones rung up for. I believe they all rang up for two dollars. Yes, all of the Dow soap you see here rang up for $2 each. So I paid $4 for those. I mean, I'm sorry, I paid $8 for those. And they double dipped with the monthly deal, which also gave you a dollar plus up. So I paid eight, got back eight $1 plus ups. Got four from the monthly deal and four from the weekly deal. So those are totally free. Now, the reason why I still got the double dip on this one, which I failed to mention in my other video, it's because this particular one is also double dipping. And it's only this one, the um, foaming. You have to get the one that says foaming. It is the white tea, as you can see down there, foaming hand wash, okay? So, I'm, yeah, I've been on slick deals again since I've been home. And it's confirmed that only the white tea foaming is also giving you the double dip. So, in my store, they only had three of the Halloween, and again, only get the ones with the pumpkin on the front. So, they only had three of those, and then I remembered someone mentioning the white tea foamy one, so I picked up those, and yes, it still gave me four $1 plus ups for the weekly, four $1 plus ups for the monthly, okay? Totally free for those. So, I just wanted to show you that in case your store doesn't have all of these, okay? Now, I did do the Scuncy deal once here where um, you buy two of them and you get, what's the deal on the Scuncy? Sorry about my phone ringing. Uh, da, da, da. Buy two of them and you get a $3 plus up. So, um, I did find the $289 um, ponytail holders. But I decided not to get them because I wanted to get something that my daughter could actually use. Um, I had plenty of those other ones. So I decided to get these. These were $2.99 each. And so I bought two of those. $2.99 kicks. Uh, uh, my gold status probably kicked in. I paid. Let me see. My receipt. I'm trying to find those items on here so I can tell you how much they actually cost <clears throat> regular price was $2.99 and I'm trying to find them on my receipt you guys and I don't oh here they go I didn't get the um I did not get my um 20% off on that that's really weird it rang up at regular price right there at $2.99 hmm I don't know why that happened so I paid $2.99 each for those, and then I got back the $3 plus up for those. I did the Tux deal. As I told you guys, that one was um, uh, they were $6.49 each. Gold status makes them $5.20. We had a $2 manufacturer coupon and a $3 in ad coupon. So basically you're paying $0.20 cents each for these. There's no plus up involved. They're just $0.20 cents each. That's a good deal. I did the Ricola deal. Buy two of those, $4 each. Use the $1 manufacturer coupons. Pay $6 and get back $5 for those. And um, the Bonnie Bell Lip Smacker things here. 
um, buy eight of them. These ones are a dollar eighty nine cents each, and I'm trying to see if they bring up a gold price. <clears throat> this receipt is so long; it's driving me crazy. No, these did not give me gold status either. So these were one eighty nine each, and then it gave. So I basically paid a little over eight dollars, and then I got back a five dollar and a four dollar plus sub. So it's still free. With a little bit of a money maker on those. I did the Revlon deal twice. I did the Max. Um, buy two. They are buy one, get one 50% off. These run $7.49. So two of them is $11.23. And since I did it twice, that would be $22.46. I used the $2 video values on each one of those, the $1 manufacturer on each one of those. Paying ten forty six, getting back eight dollars, two four dollar plus ups for that. Love these. Look at the great winter colors. Love those. Um, let's see. I did the Dove Men Care. Those were three fifty each, so that would be seven dollars. Use the two dollar manufacturer coupons, so you're paying three dollars and getting back a two dollar plus up. So making those um, fifty cents each. And I did the skin to mint as well. This one was um, not a part of a plus up deal, just a great deal because these were $349 each. My gold status kicks in at $280. Um, so that would be $560 for those two. Used uh, two of the $2 in ad coupons, it used a dollar and fifty cents off of two coupon. And so basically you're going to be that's four, five fifty. So you're paying ten cents for these two. So five cents each. That's a fantastic price. Okay. So I got those. I got the Playtex deal done on the Playtex Glide, Gentle Glide. Bought six of those, $3.99 each. Uh $23.94 for that. Use six of the two dollar video values. Use six of the one dollar manufacturer coupons. Pay five ninety four and get back a five dollar plus up on that, and that's a limit of a four on this. So I've only done it once so far, and then I got the seven up because I needed some drinks in the house. Those were I didn't put those as a part of my deals, but those were three three for twelve dollars. So those are three for twelve dollars, and then you got back the four dollar plus up which makes them three for eight. Great deal, I think, on uh, a 12-pack, three for eight on that. Okay, so I decided to get those. And I'll probably go get some more of those. So that's pretty much what I did at Rite Aid. Um, I think I'm probably going to go back later in the week to do the um, Lip Smackers again, the Revlon again. Um, probably going to get the Dowl again if I can find those. And... Um, I think I'm probably going to do everything again except the play text. I don't have um, any more of the video values to use on that. Although, if you don't have the video values, there is a $1 in-ad coupon that you can use. Um, it's just going to cost you a little bit more. Um, you're going to pay... Hmm, going to pay about six dollars more so you're going to pay a, almost twelve dollars if you're only going to use that one dollar in ad and then you're going to get back the five dollar plus up which is still a great deal for some playtex tampons so it's still a great deal so i'm going to have to think about whether i'm going to do that i don't use these products i get them for my daughter and my sister but yeah that's still a great um deal especially if you have plus ups that can cover it so that's all i did for rite aid so far you guys um i'll get to cvs later this week and um I basically, as I told you guys in my other video, I spent $41 in cash for this stuff. But I did get back a total of $67 in plus subs, okay? So, technically, I still made money, but not cold cash, all right? Thanks for watching, and happy shopping, happy savings. Bye.